The greatest trick the devil ever pulled was convincing the world he didn't exist. We are probably one of the last generations of Homo sapiens. Within a century or two, Earth will be dominated by entities that are more different from us than we are different from Neanderthals or from chimpanzees. Because in the coming generations, we will learn how to engineer bodies and brains and minds. These will be the main products of the economy, of the 21st century economy. Not textiles and vehicles and weapons, but bodies and brains and minds. For four billion years, nothing fundamental changed in the basic rules of the game of life. All of life, for four billion years, dinosaurs, amoebas, tomatoes, humans, all of life was subject to the laws of natural selection and to the laws of organic biochemistry. But this is now about to change. Science is replacing evolution by natural selection with evolution by intelligent design. Not the intelligent design of some god above the clouds, but our intelligent design and the intelligent design of our clouds, the IBM cloud, the Microsoft cloud, these are the new driving forces of evolution. Maybe the most important ex exchange in this respect will be in healthcare. The big battle over what we today call privacy will be between privacy and health. Do you give access to what is happening inside your body and brain in exchange for far better healthcare? And my guess is that health will win, hands down. People will give up their privacy in exchange for healthcare, and maybe in many places they won't have a choice. I mean, they won't even get insurance if they are unwilling to give access to what is happening inside their bodies. Do you know what my ultimate goal is? It's to take all you nitwits to hell with me.